Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 3 Part 2 15. Yep, that's right, that's right. Acura. Thing. Yeah, I don't fucking know. Anyways, let's let's finish the R1 World Championship, shall we? We're going to Laguna Seca for a finale for our 13th final race, so here we go. Well, that was almost a success. Oh, shit. Alright, let's try this again. I like, yeah, I like how the super... Oh, hey, how you doing? I like how the super Scotty actually almost worked. Alright, already have damage. That's wonderful. Jeez, 13% in the rear. Oversteer city. Alright, whatever. I can play through the pain. So, this is turned into the Laguna Seca 30 lock race. For our finale of this championship. Whoopsie. Oh well. Oh, why do you tap the brake there? Stop that. Why do you guys tap the brake in weird places? Wheel spin, fucking fuck fuck. And somehow more did not repass me through that. No idea how. Whatever. Let's just uh, go ahead and focus on Rossi here. Hopefully, um, not do as much stupid shit with him. <laughs> oh man. a little too much argy-bargy between me and Rossi and too much damage and that led to more passing us and yeah. led to a really stupid dive bomb that even Scotty McLaughlin would be like okay no that's too far and then went Fuck me. I really not like the exit of the corkscrew right now. So that rear end damage might be a factor, I'm not sure. Heh <laughs> we'll beat behind Rossi. <laughs> I haven't seen that number in a while. At least I haven't been paying attention. Or when I've been paying attention, I haven't seen that number in a long time. smoother on the exit. Even if it was kind of slow, that's not how you do that. You're not supposed to go into the dirt. You're not supposed to go into the dirt. Stop that me. I'm only getting half a second on that lap. So that's good. that half second. Down the pooper.
close enough. Oh, hi. How you doing? That did not give me any damage. Thank God. That should have given me a lot of damage. Hooray for inconsistency. With the freaking mechanical damage system. Rossi. Oh no. Unless I keep driving like that, then I won't. Oh my god. Okay. Super upset car is very fucking upset. is just kind of conspiring against me here. It's trying to do everything it can to prevent me from winning this. It's upset that I wasn't able to succeed in my first attempt at this race, clearly. Not getting away from here, Rossi. I don't know why you're trying. It's not happening. Ooh, I thought about going for a corkscrew dive, but it wasn't close enough. Oh god. save my life. I'm fairly, I think I easily got one in the last attempt. I wasn't paying attention to my lap times. I was more focused on racing, but, you know. Yeah, but, huh? I at least had one. That is a bad entry. Go for it this time, though. Okay. I tried to abort. I was not able to abort quickly enough. Okay, eight laps to go. Still plenty of time. No, stay on the road. Okay, we're good. Still going. Got him. Oh, ran him a little wide too. Whoops. Take that, Rossi. Did 
take that. Okay, now, for the second half of the race, just gotta hold the lead. <clears throat> Felt like that pass Nico Rosberg did on Verstappen at uh, Abu Dhabi. Rather, except mine wasn't as clean. I like references. <laughs> okay, here's where I'm going to gain a little bit of time on Rossi's in the second half of the lap. Pretty much from the corkscrew onwards is where I gain time. No, a mid-race camera change is not a good idea, but I do it anyways. Cause I'm crazy. Okay, call, careful car. Cue clocky car. Yes, I started over because I did not win the race last time. It's okay, I'm doing much better this time. As in, I'm actually in the lead and not getting my ass rammed by Rossi every turn. That's good. God, from this view, the corpse screw is just completely blind. feel my way through. Hey, there's that 111, finally. Yeah, I have far less damage now. Which is also really good. Got that rear end damage I got from the start. From whoever the fuck it was. Don't even remember who. It's basically just gotta bring it home. In five laps. Spin. I'll say this one, I don't even know if it's like oversteer caused by wheel spin or wheel spin caused by oversteer. It, it could be either or. That one was wheel spin. Control, man. Edge of control and edge of the track. All right, three to go. And I have a 3.7 second advantage, nice. 
Hey, look, back markers. <laughs> Not gonna catch them though, like at Road Atlanta. Unfortunately. Shitty corkscrew. Yeah, this is one of those like, tracks where the AI is fairly good. At least the first half of the track. From the corkscrew onwards, not so much. Would I take part in the Amazing Race? Fuck no. I don't have time for that probably lightly scripted shit. It's just not something I would want to do. It's not like I have, a, you know, someone who I could be partnered up to do it with, <laughs> alone, etc. Championship will be complete. So I just don't have to try any. Just don't try any funny stuff, me. Just bring it home. Got a three second cushion over Rossi. Four second cushion over Rossi, excuse me. Sun. Blinded by the light, etc. Yay! We finally did it! We completed the R1 World Championship! Oh my god, my chair is falling. Because shitty hydraulics. Well, failing hydraulics, I should say. Alright, ooh. Looks like we got some shenanigans in this race. We got Jones and the Panos running fifth. That's interesting. Evans is in sixth. Brown in the uh, the P2 Acura is in fourth. Well then, interesting uh, running order for this result. Interesting result for this race. There, <laughs> that's better. Ah, oh, God, has such a way with words, and all those ways are not. Aren't. So Brown takes fourth. Jones is going to take fifth in the Panos. Uh, uh, oh my god, they're taking forever to finish. My car is in turn 11. They're still not done. There we go. Finally across the line. Alright, hold on. No effect on points because all the points were settled four races ago, but hey, at least Jones got a few more points out of this, so that's cool. There we go. R1 World Championship Season 6 of Season Play Mode. 
is finally complete. Hooray. So now we get loads of money. So we get 33 grand for extra for winning the race, and for winning every race, 428,000. Nice. Congratulations. You finished season six. Oh yeah. Hooray. Also you notice uh says next year's class R1 World Championship. Uh season play is finished. We got our achievement year six, so yeah. I could uh continue on the shenanigans here with season seven. But we just be doing the R1 World Championship over again, and basically season play mode is done. I mean, like, you just use it at this point if you want more money at the end of the se of uh, each series, but that's about it as far as that. So, there we go. We finished all six of the years that matter of season play. I mean, there aren't even any more achievements. So, uh, there's all the R1 World Championship races, so yeah. That's finally done, so... From now on, we'll just do this shit in the event list. I don't really need all that money. So. Yeah. Anyways, that's done. We'll move on back to the Speedway Challenges with the S-Class Speedway Challenge in the next segment. So with that, stay tuned for more Forza Motorsport 3.